more more people that get these brackets in this area of the neighborhood than um, a higher bracket because of the low uh, low um, job that there is in Houston. So we got um, the higher one by fifty k's to a hundred k, and there's um this this percentage is actually the biggest. So it's actually the ones that have degrees and uh, like holding down actually the uh, job with um. Uh, instead of a uh, blue collar job. So next slide. And so the statistics, so basically the graph <coughs> of a blue collar worker is a um, higher average in person than um, a degree holder. Next slide. Um, the model and median, the model of the salary bracket is 0 to 25K. The median salary bracket is 25K to 50K. And the mean of the salary is um, 40.60k. So um, actually, the mean is the uh, average, and the mode is like we're seeing more, most common, most common and uh, the median is um, price in the middle. Yeah, the price in the middle. So um, we, um, let me ask you to show a job that we were actually preferred, one that we want to pursue. So uh, my fellow classmate is Miranda chose psychology and um, psychologist and sorry. And um, the child basically describes your income throughout the whole year. And um, the average of the whole year you're gonna get is ninety one thousand five hundred seventy five. And we get a statistics about it in Chicago, based on Chicago because there is an information about psychology psychology in person. So we were uh, paying attention that there's a high crime area in this person, so um, there's a lot of gang activity, so and a lot of um, like domestic. So we're saying that um, psycho, psych, there's a uh, needs to be more people based in this career, so there could be offices to offer people services here. So many of the crimes could go down. Next time, and we're done. thank you very much. Types of races that are in person. 
What races live in Pilsen? There are Hispanic, Blacks, White, and others. Races that are impacted by poverty in Chicago are Latinos. Uh, they have 36%. Blacks have 50 Whites only have 8.8%. Asians have 15.4%. The household size. Uh, two to nine people live in an average house in Pilsen. Uh, 50.7 families. 21.1 uh, .1 are married couples with kids. 10.5 are single moms. 30.5 are single men, 15 and over. Median rent is $608 and $925. An average house in person has two floors. No question. Do you know what the poverty level is? Or the poverty level? Um, me, myself, I'm not really sure. So, I one of the slides I noticed that a lot of people, like 30% are living in poverty, but only 11 or 12% have corporate assistance. Why do you think that's a big difference there? Mm -hmm. Or do you know like, what, what people need to qualify for public assistance? And why are um, people getting it? Assistance. For assistance, I think it would, they would have to have like a, like a disability of some sort so they can qualify for like certain things from the government. Mm -hmm. I don't know. 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 Ask your group members. I don't know. None of my group's here. I think like from the part you have to like be qualified that like, you have to have a certain income right. from like no income to maybe like 40,000. I'm not sure like what's the... I think you could get like food, right? Like you go yeah, to like, like churches and they offer like food or something like that. Is that what you're school. For school. Yeah. For, school. Um, for my hours, I, um, I help out a church. I don't know that. I help out a church. Um, food pantry, you know, people, food people like at 9 in the morning, give out food. And that's pretty much it. You know, just give out free food, I guess. Didn't you Um, there's pride in ownership which ties you to your community 
and the interest of the <coughs> tax portion of your mortgage is tax deduction, which means like you could um, the payments you make for your mortgage or your taxes for your home, you can claim it on your taxes and then you can send them back. Uh, the disadvantages of homeowning is uh, <coughs> homeownership is a long-term financial commitment. Uh, you're responsible for all the maintenance work, like, like on the house. So it's inexpensive repairs, like uh, fixing a toilet or expensive furnace. Uh, mortgage payments are fixed. They're more expensive than renting costs. <coughs> and the uh, bank can take your home away if you don't make your mortgage payments. <coughs> property taxes. Uh, 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 you got a question, you got a question. Okay, so based on the advantages and disadvantages, <laughs> personally, which would you guys prefer, to rent or buy a house? Um, um, personally, I think rent, I would rent. Why? <coughs> I mean, because it's cheaper. And like, it is, when you, when you own a home, it's like a lot to pay, and it is a financial commitment that you guys have to keep for a long time. Okay. I'd rather own it. Yeah. Uh, it's just a minor In the long run, I think I think renting will cost them a lot. <coughs> so I know one of the sites you said if you're if you buy a home and build back to you, what does that mean? Uh, if you like, can explain it. Which one do you prefer living?
Ja, ja. 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 